I'm getting ready to turn on this uh, six channel transmitter. Before you do that, just check to make sure all the switches are in the proper positions, uh, default positions, and the throttle is set to zero. At this stage, it doesn't really matter whether you turn the transmitter on first or not. Uh, it's only after you bind the software and bind the receiver that you want to make sure that you always turn the transmitter on before you apply power to the receiver. Otherwise, it'll lose uh, its, uh, its binding. In this particular case, though, we're going to initialize the binding, and in that case, you usually start the receiver first or put power to the receiver and then turn on the transmitter and go to the binding function on the menu. This, uh, of course, is a six-channel uh, transmitter, uh, but it's uh, got an eight-channel receiver, and it doesn't really matter. I've used this six-channel for almost every project I have, and it's rare when I need more than six channels, uh, depending on uh, you know what type of devices and how many devices I've got hooked up to, to the quad plane or to the drone.